in this video i am going to show how i solved view content event missing some deduplicate parameter problem let's see i am in my google tag manager container and you can see here is the two different uh, tag for each event we have to find the view content tag for two different tags so this is view content for browser side and view content for server side and first of all you have to go on the browser side tag and just see what i did actually i just select the facebook incubator template and i have uh, select uh, the, the facebook pixel id and in standard i just select view content and then the important part is and the mode setting just select the event id variable so how can you find it just you have to click on this button and if you don't see here just click on building and click on here and click on search and you have to search here event id just keep in mind guys you have to added event id parameter and then you have to make a variable then you can see this gallery and then you can see a name here it's called event id variable and then you can save it and i already did it that's why it's showing here so it's event id variable i just click on here and selected it and our trigger is view items and then save it and if you uh, want to do it on server side uh, you have to make a tag for view content event just see uh, i have select here ga4 event because i am using uh, ga4 schema for uh, conversion api and i have uh, this event name is view item and just see here a lot of param event parameter i've made it here and the important part is event id variable you have to make it otherwise you are f you will face the deduplication problem and when you made it you have to sub mm, click on save and then submit it i think your problem will be solved you can visit my website mdnasimreza.com then you will see i am providing digital marketing service for building and scaling online business also i am the top rated freelancer on upwork.com you can contact me on facebook and whatsapp that you will see on my website feel free to contact me if you need my help thanks for watching this video if you think this video was helpful for you you can give me a like and if you want to see more video from me you can subscribe my channel i think you will never be disappointed because every time i am publishing useful video on my youtube channel also if you have any single suggestion for me you can give it to me on comment box i really appreciate it that's all for today see you on the next video till then take care bye bye have a good day